this program is specifically tailored to people probably kind of eight to ten years in their career who probably uh, reached a, a high level of achievement uh, as creative people and as creative leaders but now thinking about the, the, the broader perspective for how uh, the industry um, evolves and, and what their uh, the part that they can play in it. It is really important to go and do something that broadens your mind in this arena at the time that is right for you. It could be 24, it could be 44, it could be 54, but I don't think it's an age thing. I think it's what you're doing at the time, your experience, your background. I'd recommend it to myself. Uh, I'd like to do it. Uh, I would encourage all the other employers in the creative industries to follow Channel 4's lead on this. I think uh, David's commitment to bursaries this evening is really significant. This MBA is going to capture our creative industries, fuse it with the technology and the new platforms, infuse it with business skills and knowledge, and we're going to create our business and entrepreneurs of the future. It's a remarkably interesting but also very difficult job working with people who work with huge passion who work with huge talent and often in very, very specialised roles to take an overview of all of those roles, lead and inspire them so that they can innovate further and actually deliver hugely profitable uh, products, uh, businesses and industries. I would argue that creativity is what turns complex ideas into practical solutions. <clears throat> now, resilience, interestingly, is not taught at any school or college in the country. Nobody teaches resilience. We need to capture the brilliance of our industries and their many success stories and lock in the future for the next generation of leaders that Sir David talked about. So this program is really an idea uh, whose time has come. The creative industries in the UK really punch above their weight uh, in terms of innovation and employment. Uh, but to remain competitive, one of the critical things I've always felt is that we've got to be uh, as good at uh, business uh, thinking as well as creative innovation. The business isn't a dirty word, it's a great thing, it's a wonderful skill to have alongside your creative skills. And many people have it, but not enough. As I stand here today, I couldn't be more excited about looking out at the horizons for the creative industries. We see really strong growth, one of the fastest industry growth in this country. It's aspirational, it's future-proof, it really is an industry for the 21st century, and the UK is unbelievably good at it, and we lead the world. So come on, join in. It's all about the creative industries.